Hi, this is a quick screencast to show you how you can share file assessment. Now, it's quite possible that um, your assessment has been set up to auto submit, in which case when you took a copy of the piece of work uh, that you've been given, then it will have automatically shared it for assessment. But if either um, you're having to manually submit your assessment in Pebblepad, or there's been something that's gone wrong with the auto submit and you're having to manually submit um, because of that, then this is how you would do it. So I'm now in my Pebble Pad, my Pebble Plus account. This is my uh, home screen and I'm going to go to my asset store. So I'm going to go to the burger menu, click on my assets and then the, the piece of work I'm wanting to submit for assessment is this one, the portfolio my one portfolio to rule them all and over here on the right hand side I've got a, a picture of a little eye and if I click on that it'll give me the information and I'm going to click on I want to and I'm going to go to share and then I've got the option here who I would like to share it with and I'm going to the bottom because I'm going to share for assessment Okay, now it might be that more than one workspace shows up, but I've just got the one. And can I share yet? There's a tick. Now the title of the workspace is quite likely going to be exactly the same title as your black bar module site and the module that it is that you're submitting to. So if I click on, if you click on that, um, this is where you can see it uh, the the whole title, and you can check that that is the the right name of the uh, module and again if it is tied to a black bar module it will actually give you the module code the specific identifying number for that module so again you can check that against blackboard if you're just wanting to double check but it shouldn't be a problem and um, there's then a terms of usage at the bottom so um I recommend you read this obviously but uh, in, as a gist uh, when obviously you share something for assessment it means other people are going to be able to see it so people only people involved in in your assessment that have been given access rights to your assessment through shoe so um, it is you know restricted to only people that should be being able to see it but it's important to know that you are sharing it where um, where marks and things will be able to see it if you're happy with that, you can tick the box to say share for assessment and then click on the button at the bottom and share is successful. So now um, it should be, you can see this clipboard here with a one next to it. That's showing and telling me that that's been shared for our assessment. And if I click on that and I scroll down in your information now from this point onwards, it will show you that it's shared for assessment and it will give you the details again of where it's been shared to. Um, you do have the ability to ask for the submission to be removed, but once you've shared an assessment, I really recommend um, not removing it. Uh, if there is a problem or there's something you need to check, I would recommend getting in touch with the module leader uh, for the module that you're studying to get that sorted out. And there you go, that's how you share for assessment. Thank you for watching.